Now on to some with the Mungai Eve findings with the recent report by singer and songwriter Willie Paul that exuded claims of his YouTube account being tampered with. Tremendous growth has been witnessed in the last 24 hours after the release of the new song with the clones melody and Musa Jakadala titled Atoti Jaber. Now through the social media account, particularly Instagram, his management Saldido wrote and I quote, it has come to my attention that some malicious fellows have tampered with social media sites, especially on the YouTube channel of our artist Willy Paul. Inadvertently, we are unable to release the latest hit song artist Willie Paul Atoti Jaber, we ask for patience as we are working towards it." End of quote. Pose went ahead and commented that he would let the public be aware of the people behind the altercation. The song that graced Saldido Saini is currently at 160,000 views in the last 24 hours. Gospel artist and proclaimed chairman Rington Apoko has however went ahead and claimed Willie Paul had stolen the song from him. And in reply, Willie Pose has responded and I quote, those of you that know Rington know the kind of person he is. My brother, please stop telling your friends that I stole the song Atoti Jaber from you. It has never been a gospel song. Enough with your clout chasing bro. It's 2022. New beginnings. I love and respect you as a big brother who came to this industry just before me. End of quote. This buck drops the two-month-old Viambo song that celebrates 7 million views by singer and husband to Diana Bahati. Bahati, however, clinched 522,000 views within a day when the song was being premiered. In the song that he collaborated with two Luo artists, Pris Inda, that featured several popular artists like MP Babu Owino, Eric Omondi, among others, we hope Willie Paul's videos will get to feet and attain desired views after the social media scaffold. Give this video a thumbs up, but don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell. I'm Kingsley Luoko for Mungai Eve, Entertainment News.